Lee Marvin Bennett. Fight against them that fight against me and stand up for my aim. What's good guys? Welcome back. You know it's a boy real Marvin Bennett so they are with me look cool. Watch them then. Glad to come by my camera and so watch them. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Anyway yeah, guys, we there. I'm cause boy. So the testimony money me apologize. Guys, trust me. Make the bike a pass. Explain what go on to you. Know. Oh, bike now pass it's not this one. Guys, me I tell you guys, trust me. Sick out. Sick out. Go eat one food. Buy food on the road and trust me, because you know we do a lot of traveling um over the place so buy one food and the food trust me never good and um, mash me up and we did end up if we go um, at the airport this morning early and me I tell us me just just because I'm a person of commitment you understand and if me tell us me I go do something for you me I go do it you understand so me did end up go at the airport this morning we left out some minutes after 4 a.m and we reach back home uh to eat Thank you, thank you. <laughs> we need to eat. We have one Yes, guys, so. I just I smoke. Never feel right at all. I have to take some rest and get some tea, some tough crackers, and you know. Alright, brandy. <laughs> some tough crackers and stuff, guys, so. That was it. Really apologize. Have everything set up. Couldn't touch the phone. Couldn't do no video in it. It's so bad, trust me. But you know, we are here at Secret at George's Plain and we are here to have a cup of wampus time. So, you know, me I'm going to make up feet, right? Yes, guys, but because of testimony Monday, we don't want to put it on my other day. Alright? But you know, me I'm going to make up back feet. So, we are going to jump right into another video, you know, guys. Alright? So, let's have some fun in Jesus. George's Plain. Oh, go. Green Jill. Up a Green Jill. Current did go on. Have you seen he's a miracle in that? No, no, we come at Jordi's plane. I know current again. Bishop Gray, then they are singing, I have a God who never feels. <laughs> <laughs> so she have a God who never feels. So. We are telling her, really, we are telling her. <laughs> No current again in our church, guys. <laughs> current, <laughs> current day everywhere, but no current day in our church. But you know, when you know that you are here for a blessing, it's like you put on something you just come feet. You understand? Yeah, so. That's a go on, guys. I'm with my sister, Peter Gay French. Yeah, so make sure you jump over to our channel. See your mommy say it, Peter Gay French. So you look rock a jump start to rock with Look at Rocko Jump, first time Rocko Jump guys. Alright guys, see there? Light, come on. Light, so as we say. It's like we just put on we break through over there, so we are going to feed.
Where are the apostles? From the rest of the people. And sit on the next video. Shall I praise the Lord? Come on, somebody, praise the Lord. Uh, my team to you tonight is Don't Grudge Your Brother. Oh, bless the Lord, somebody. Come on, somebody, praise the Lord. Come on, somebody, praise the Lord. If you see me, if you see me buy a new car tomorrow, don't grudge me. Tell me praise the Lord, somebody. Come on, somebody, praise the Lord. If you see me buy a new house tomorrow morning, don't grudge me. Shall we praise the Lord? Come on, somebody, praise the Lord. I do remember there is two brothers in the Bible. Shall we praise the Lord? Cain and Abel. Oh, bless the Lord, somebody. Oh, praise the Lord, somebody. And it reached a point where they have to make an offering unto God. Oh, bless the Lord. Oh, bless the Lord, somebody. Come on, somebody, praise the Lord. And you know, God accept Cain offering, Abel's offering, shall we praise the Lord? And rejected Cain. Shall we praise the Lord, somebody? Come on, somebody, praise the Lord. Come on, somebody, praise the Lord. And that Christ came to have envy in his heart. Shall we praise the Lord, somebody? Come on, somebody, praise the Lord, somebody. And you need to understand in life that you, you, are going, you have to go through stages. Oh, bless the Lord, somebody. Come on, somebody, praise the Lord. Come on, somebody, praise the Lord. So when you see me elevating, yes. and when you see me getting up in life, don't grudge me, shall we yes. praise the Lord? Come on, somebody, praise the Lord. Come on, somebody, praise the Lord. Don't bring me down through my stress. Don't bring me down through my situation. Oh, bless the Lord, somebody. Oh, come on, praise the Lord, somebody. This is my fears in Jesus. Wonderful, wonderful. Shall we worship the Lord? Worship the Lord. Let me give honor to the Spirit of God to our Metropolitan Primates. As Paul said, men and brethren, I greet you in the mighty name of Jesus. Shall we worship the Lord? Worship the Lord. I am listening to your voice, O oh Lord. I am listening to your voice. tonight my team to you is hearken diligently unto the voice of the Lord somebody shout hallelujah shout hallelujah because I understand when you hearken diligently unto the voice of the Lord then some blessing shall be bestowed upon you somebody shout hallelujah tonight you shall be blessed in the cities and you shall be blessed in the field mighty God you shall be above you shall not be beneath. You shall be the head tonight and not the tail. All you need to do tonight is to hearken diligently unto the voice of the Lord. You see, tonight, blessed be the name of Jesus. My, my bishop called me and she said to me, I'm asking you to be in George's plane tonight. And I said to her, I can't make it because I have test, I have school. But then the voice said to me, you need to be there. I don't know what is going to happen to me tonight. But I'm telling somebody, I come with my faith to light you up. Somebody shout hallelujah. Somebody shout hallelujah. You see, we are the chosen few tonight. Let's see the name of Jesus. I'm telling you this tonight. All you need to do is to lift up your face. Because I know that there is a prophet here. Oh, bless be the name of Jesus. You see, I might not testify. But I can tell you that I have a lot of testimonies tonight. Somebody shout hallelujah. And I can tell you all you need to do is to listen to the voice of the Lord. God bless you in Jesus' name. Praise the Lord. Let me worship the Lord. Amen. Tonight, let me give honor to the Spirit of God, who is the head of our life. Amen. Then to our Metropolitan Town, the bishops and visiting friends, I greet you all in the mighty name of Jesus. Let me bless the name of Jesus. Amen. Tonight, I hear a question asked: Which one of my good work? Bless the name of Jesus. Are you stoning me for? Bless the name of Jesus. Is it because I'm a tight spare? Hallelujah. Is it because I'm a worshiper? Bless the name of Jesus. Is it because I'm fighting? Tell him, bless the name of Jesus. Because in this time and season, it's not easy for young folks to worship God. So when you see me trying my best, fighting to live for the Lord, is it that you stoning me for? You stoning me for because when we get a look at change, we have to be able to tell you that we are afraid of. Which one of my good work are you spawning me for?
love. Because some people we are look to encourage you. Lord God Almighty, you can't find them. I said, church people talk about me more than I'm saved. And sometimes when we hear this talk with them say, Lord Jesus, my belly bought me. Me I ask God, is it me they're talking about? Because we don't know what I say. I keep my birthday party Saturday and I decided I don't want no outlaw music then. And I stand up on my foot. I say I don't want nobody playing no outlaw music. And bless the name of Jesus this morning I went to look for my nephew. And when I was coming back back her auntie stopped me. He said girl, Lord Jesus I always see you as a woman of God. And I always respect you. But more God and funny because I want to follow your channel. I want to listen Jesus, I thank you. I said, Mommy, guess what? I just confirmed on your road. And X, Y, Z said to me, she wasn't listening to hear the type of music I'm a player. But she don't hear my dirty music. I said, who could it be but Jesus? I'm on the right track. Because the rest is not for the sweep. Not the back of the strong. But it's for those who endure. Bishop Carr, which one of the good words is is it because you're prophesying? Is it because God is blessing you? Bishop, what is one of the good work? Bishop, there, ask yourself the question and encourage yourself tonight. God bless you. In Jesus' name. Oh, my God. 
Unity. The Bible said that the three evils born. And then find himself in our situation. But Daniel did already speak to them. So they know when the enemy comes, they know exactly what to do. In the name of Jesus. So the position that these boys reach in it is a position that they have a choice. Yes. Mm. Either you're going to go and live, or are you going to stand and die? They don't know what is coming, you know. Go but they understand because they have a good leader. Daniel may they know no matter what happened. Keep trusting in God. So the problem comes. Shedrach, come on to know what I will do. Mishrak, no one to know what I will do. So it's a mind made up thing now. They say, yes, we have a good leader. This is what we are going to do. We are going to stand together. And if we be dead, we have to be dead. So you're not here. Yes. 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 Y
Sweet Holy Ghost. Sweet Holy Ghost. Sweet Holy Ghost. Sweet Holy Ghost. Holy Ghost. Holy Ghost. Jesus, then he will surely be you. Somebody will show up. Amen. Virgin, we have to start taking you on the side now because we start work hard. Somebody will show up because the blessing is coming. Somebody will show up. And you have to understand the blessing of the Lord. Somebody will show up. I don't know about you, but my God is a covenant God. Somebody will show up. So if you make a covenant with God, then he will fulfill whatsoever you ask him for. Somebody will show up. But sometimes the problem is we fail to carry out our part. Agreement, somebody worship the Lord. We fail to carry out our part of the bargain. Somebody worship the Lord. So we find ourselves stuck and cannot move. Somebody worship the Lord. Because each time we go and we ask God for something and He deliver it to us, then we mess it up. Somebody worship the Lord. When that husband comes, we mess it up. When that car comes, we mess it up. When that wife comes, we mess it up. When the money comes, we drink it out. When we get the house, we whoop it out. Somebody worship the Lord. But I remember the woman, somebody worship the Lord. This such woman, somebody worship the Lord. She couldn't bear any child. Somebody worship the Lord. But she understand her calling. Somebody worship the Lord. And she understand the anointing that the prophet carries. Somebody worship the Lord. So tonight I come not with my problem. I come not with my burden. But I come to serve the prophet. Because the Bible says if you bless a prophet in the name of a prophet. Then a prophet reward you shall receive. So you understand that woman, this woman take care of the man of God. Somebody worship the Lord. Knowing her problem, and she did not say to the metropolitan. Sometimes someone we have breathed blue upon we are called a person. Somebody worship the Lord. But I hear somebody say, How can we make it without fasting and prayer? Because when you fast and pray, God will release some things to the apostle. And I guess your blessing I go come. And this is your prophecy you go come. Sometimes we just need to prepare a table for the man of God. Call him and wash some and close them. Give him some food. Buy him some gas. Take care of the prophet. Somebody worship the Lord. Because that's where the blessing is. And some of us will feel to take care of ourselves. Most of us will take care of the prophet. We mean to be self. So if we mean to be self, we will give prophet. Some of us will be chatting prophet. So how we feel blessed? We know bless because we are kicked against the brick. But I understand that this woman take care of the prophet. She makes sure she, she, she tell her husband. Some of we are doing things without him. Ask me husband, you know. And we don't ask the wife, you know. And the Bible says when they are married, they become one. So we're supposed to come in one agreement. Somebody worship the Lord. So she asks her husband, she says, Hussey, this man is a man of God. And when he comes, I'm going to need a place to rest. And not only that, I'm going to need a table where he can look and dip in for all the line and he can write. Somebody worship the Lord. And a bed, somebody worship the Lord. And a chair so that he can sit on. Somebody worship the Lord. And the husband didn't withheld. Somebody worship the Lord. The big, the good husband, them and I host, just pick up yourself right now. Because you are some husband and you support their wife. And you are some wife and you support their husband. And I hear somebody say, you like them. So I understand that the woman, I'm coming down, the woman, she take care of the prophet, she do. What the prophet want? Yeah. We know the prophet have to ask for it. Some of you are with my apostle, we play with that, and we are Lord Jesus. Somebody worship the Lord, too much revelation in this tonight. Somebody worship the Lord, but she take care of the prophet. And the prophet of our conscience is no, I cannot bless this, I cannot leave this woman like this. Somebody worship the Lord. So she sent her servant, somebody worship the Lord, to ask the woman what she wants. Somebody worship the Lord. Lord Jesus, the woman of our problem, she never said to the prophet, Who are your problem? If you work for Jesus, then he will surely bless you. Somebody worship the Lord. Just leave your hand We are not a prophet, but I'm a son of a prophet tonight. Somebody worship the Lord. I come to tell somebody that whatsoever your problem is, I'm not going to tell you this time next year. I'm going to tell you this time tomorrow. This time next week, you will receive your blessing. God bless you in Jesus' name. Hallelujah. Somebody praise the name of Jesus. Yeah. Lift your hands and magnify the name of Jesus. Stand on your feet and magnify the name of Jesus. Yeah. Call out the name of Jesus. 
if you know who he is, call out the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. Amen. Hallelujah. Bless the Lord. Tonight, let me greet God, who is the head of our life. Amen. Then to our metropolitan primate in the house, to all the bishops in the house tonight. Let me greet you all in the name of Jesus Christ, our soon coming King. Somebody praise the Lord. the name of Jesus. Amen. And there was a time when Paul left Antioch and went to a place called Iconium. Amen. Somebody bless the Lord. Amen. But before Paul went there, Amen, Timothy was already there paving the way for Paul. Somebody bless the name of Jesus some good example yes, man. Yes. amen creating some good image about the apostle the man of God yes, man. Yes, man. somebody bless the name of Jesus yes, somebody bless the name of Jesus yes, amen and there was a man by the name of one Sinimus hallelujah come on. Come on. a very highly respectable man in the community yes. Hearing about Paul was expecting to meet the man of God. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. And when Paul arrived, there was two brethren with him. Somebody bless the name of Jesus. Amen. Amen. And when Paul arrived, and Paul was greeted and was saluted as a man of God, the two that were with him get corrupt. Oh, hallelujah. Amen, amen. The two that was with him get corrupt. And this is what they say. They say, are we not man of God as he did? And how you salute the man of God, so who are we? Oh, somebody bless the name of Jesus. Somebody bless the name of Jesus. Amen. You see, the problem in the house of God today is that everybody wants to be recognized. Oh, oh God Almighty, can I talk to you tonight, church? Oh God, everybody wants to be the main event. Everybody wants to be the main subject. Somebody bless the Lord. And they get corrupt against the apostle. And say, listen, this man that anoint me, this man that lift me up, this man is preaching false doctrine. So if the apostle who 
a nine to a priest for adoption. What do you preach? Oh God Almighty. Somebody bless the name of Jesus. I said, envy reach them heart. Oh God, oh God. Somebody praise the name of Jesus. I said, but mine reach them heart. A grateful reach them heart. Over the very salute that the man has got to receive. All of the very love that the man has got to receive. All of the very word that the man has got done. Because he set an example. He had nine Timothy. And he said, be it away from me. And Timothy set a good example. I said, Licky little people can't place over church. Fleshy, fleshy people can't place over church. Red eyed people can't place over church. Because we send them there and try to defeat you. Come on, come on, come on. So listen. The question asks Which of my good work am I spoon for? If you work no good, you're not getting a stone. Oh, oh God, oh God. Somebody bless the name of Jesus. Somebody bless the name of Jesus. Can I just share a little revelation with you? It doesn't matter how you're anointed. It doesn't matter how you're powerful. The moment the devil see your intention, that is when he's coming after you. So them set up Paul. But my Paul. Scandal Paul. Disgrace Paul. Lord Jesus. Them say, listen. Paul I preach one doctrine. And I tell his sister, them say, they're nothing married. And all what Paul was saying. If you keep your virginity, you stay closer to God. You are better for God. You live better for God. And it disturbs somebody. It mess up the governor. Oh God Almighty. It mess up a city. Oh God. It enjoyed some people that was anointed. Because remember, the two that were with Paul, they were anointed. They were Paul's spiritual son. Come on, come on. They were Paul's spiritual son. Come on. They were in Antioch with Paul. But as soon as Paul reached Iconium, and then believed that Paul get a salute that he shouldn't get, unless they were getting and get come. Praise God, give him love of the honor and the glory of the praise. You're really, hallelujah, give some powerful word. Amen. I just want to touch him up as I go along. But let me greet God and his angel. We're going straight to the team scripture. Praise the Lord. Amen. We, you know, I have something to say, but you know what? As I'm, I'm, I'm going with the main bishop tonight. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah to God. With everybody going with the bishop, I'm going with the bishop. <laughs> Amen. The bishop make a team out of the service. Come on, somebody, praise the Lord. As power, my voice can greet me to Christ Jesus in me. Greet the Christ in you. Somebody praise the Lord. Let the first speaker come and speak about Cain and Abel. Let, that, let us say what the team said. Verse 32, Jesus said unto them. Jesus was speaking here. My many good works. Hello. Hello. Not one, not two, not three. Amen. Many good works. And there was a lot of people calling like them have it all put together. But everything that you do, it must be done with two or more testimony. Yeah. 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 Somebody praise the Lord, church. Yeah. And some not have no testimony. Come and some of them are carrying you down where up the testimony. Come on. Come on, somebody praise the Lord. Yeah. Some not have no life a living, but them are carrying you down where carry the life a living. Yeah. Can I talk to somebody? Some not have no love, but them are talk about you. Full of love. Somebody praise the Lord. Can I have the church to praise the Lord? Are you going to dare on me today? Let me hear your praise the Lord. If you have no praise the Lord. If you're not back to bring the praise the Lord. If you're not stone one another, praise the Lord. If you're not carrying on your horse, praise the Lord. If you're not carrying on the church, praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord, church. Lord God, that we 
have some good, 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 good wife and your husband is stone them. We have some good, 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 good husband and the wife them stone them. You stone them with the church brother. You stone them with the church sister. You stone them with the neighbor. You stone them with the unseen. You know to how can stone them. You know text and stone them. You know what praise the Lord because you are stoner. I'm a stone at night time. Two hours upon the phone. I stone the church. Somebody praise the Lord. Here we are going with her. Cause some people keep you smile. A plastic smile. Can I talk to somebody? And everybody has a prayer talk tonight. And if your conscience sets you free. Come on with me, huh? You will get me easy, huh? But if you hold wood for me, huh? I'm gonna give it to you, huh? I'm grateful, huh? After you fill your belly, huh? You wipe your mouth like a duck, huh? I go on like nothing happened, huh? Somebody praise the Lord, huh? You pull up your belly with people business, huh? You pull up your belly with people story. You murder, and you kill, huh? And you say you're innocent. The first speaker talk about Cain and Abel. Somebody praise the Lord. Oh, thank you, being so a gift. Somebody praise the Lord. The gift went no good. Now got some gift from Mama. Yes, guys. So do you have it? Off? I'm planning on a semi sick. I don't know. I can't go to church and act sick. Trust me. I don't know. I call it me sick. I can't act sick. So guys, trust me. When I need to go catch you as a preaching over the apostle page, apostle. Ray Anthony Foster, trust me, it may not like the service nice. Trust me, the service nice. And man, the exalted them. Virgin, you know, just drop it in the comment section for the exalted them. Just say amen. <laughs> you know, just say amen to the word or something. But you know, only need to go comment. Yeah. And give video a like. Trust me, God bless you. We love you all. See you guys in our next video. All right? We're out. Stand up for my heaven, Lord. <laughs>